Here we are in Gresham, about one month after the last Paradise Restored worker left, pruning some trees and things like that. Just trying to give you an update on this property. This is my half mode grass. Still using an electric power mower that's on a charger and it keeps running out of battery life too quickly. This grass grows very quickly. Just pointing out this fence that of course we'd wanted replaced during the summer. Turns out the owners had a few other projects in mind. And so we came by with a uh, five gallon bucket of brownish paint and painted the side of the house to reduce the amount of uh, you know, the spectacle of this ugly fence, but it actually looks a lot better without the white cracking and peeling paint. I replaced a couple boards and it is now actually passable. Anyway, this is just the east side of the property we've been doing outside of the paint. We put together a egress well wall. And that was designed by Shelley, who was meticulous in keeping those bricks level and uh, consistent so the window which swings out would actually still swing out all the way without hitting the wall. So it's turned out really nice. This side of the house is mostly complete. We've got a few plants still to throw into place, but uh, you can see there's netting on there and netting way back in the back near the shed as the deer have found the plants that they like. Here's another look at the grass seed that we had done over a month ago now. A couple patches here on the close side need to be uh, repatched, overseeded, and it's looking much better though overall. We've had some cooler temperatures so we haven't had to water every single day and uh, the leaves are falling, it's getting to be fall. Things are starting to come together however and look pretty nice prior to the fall. There's still some summer left. There's the big spruce trees. The yard's grass is at least walkable now. You can tell that it might need, need to give a few, few more seeds to, to darken it up a little bit, make it a little more dense. Here's the upper level patio. And we got a couple moly friends that keep coming and disturbing my, my lawn, my mulch. So anyway, that's how it's looking there. From this side, of course, is the garage that was entirely excavated on the west side. Coming down the hill, you can see the sport court has a new addition, an actual basketball goal, which was, uh, as you saw in a previous video, I personally dug the hole and then we had nine 80 pound bags of concrete to install the foundation for the pole and it's turned out pretty nice and it adjusts from seven and a half feet to ten feet so young and old can have a good old time on the sport court which is just a lot of fun anyway things are growing some things aren't we got a couple plants still to replace that one's not looking too good but uh, the grass looks great the walkway came in as, as planned, looks wonderful, and we're very happy with the work of Paradise Restored on this property. And Legged Asphalt, who did a good job on the, the driveway itself, really makes it a lot less maintenance and one continuous surface. Still have a few downspouts to install properly. Outside of that, most things are in order. We'll take one look toward the back patio. This will not be the last video, but this is maybe one of the better looking ones considering the fall is on its way. We might end up getting a whole bunch of leaves everywhere, but uh, definitely not as many as last year as we've pruned every, had every plant pruned. It's the old patio table we've had for a long time. Some updated patio furniture and the grill are new. 
But anyway, it's turning out pretty well. Cannot wait to see how these plants on the patio terrace here grow the barberries and the like. It's been a long summer of work out here by the workers and our own sweat labor. But overall, we're pretty pleased. Anyway, you guys have a nice rest of the summer. I will be coming up with another video later on as we reveal more of the Gresham House landscape project. Take care.